This is the new R11S driver. So we've done a couple things here to try and improve the speed of the club head. We've changed the pocket on the sole, so we're going to get a faster head speed here. We've moved the weights a little bit forward, and we've actually streamlined the shape of those as well. So that's going to give us a little bit more speed, maybe about one or 200 RPMs lower spin, which should give you more distance. We've changed the flight control sleeve. Instead of one degrees, it's now one and a half degrees. So that gives us some more range as well. We've gone to a five position ASP to dial you in even more. When you have a five position sole plate with a one and a half degree sleeve, you match up wherever you want to get the exact loft and face angle. All right, well, I'm gonna set it uh, a little bit close okay. on the face angle. So I'll go see. All right. All right. Okay. That looks a little high, you think? Yeah. Yeah, a little, a little bit, bit high. high. Yeah. So that's the standard setting. I know you're typically a little yeah. stronger than that. You want to go one notch lower or two? One is enough. That'll be three quarters. Yeah. Okay, ball speed jumped up a little bit, Serge. I went to 172. We're getting about 309 on that one. How do you like the feel of the uh, the head itself? It's probably a little bit too heel weighted, yeah. Okay, let's change that. Let's go uh, ten and six. How's that? Cool. Yeah, perfect. That was better. That definitely felt better. Yeah, again, really good numbers there. So it's one seventy three. Uh, that went to 312. That was nice. 173 ball speed. So it was up on average, probably three miles an hour versus your current one. Total distance, you're averaging about 309. That's pretty good. awesome. Yeah, that's good. That's going to be fun to play with next year. <laughs> it definitely will be. <laughs>